So now when I click on this, uh, Google Plus takes a little while to get used to, but uh, but I, I want to keep this simple. I just want to talk about Google Hangouts on Air. So to create a Google Hangout on Air, I just go to the top left here and then go to Hangouts. So I'll click on that. And there's all this information, and it's a little bit confusing, uh, but there's really two versions of Hangouts. There's one that's just video Hangouts, and that's not live. Well, it is live, but it's really like a web conferencing platform where you're just meeting with maybe one or two uh, fellow students or maybe your instructor. And, um, you know, you can share documents, uh, but it's not it's not recorded. To record a live event, you need uh, to start a Hangout on Air. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to click on that. And then I'm just going to call this... Uh, group, oop, group, a hangout on air because I'm assuming you would be using it for a group presentation. I'm going to schedule it for later, and let's say I'll schedule it for. Let me see, maybe two, two p.m. for thirty minutes. Your presentations might be a lot shorter than that but you can set the duration there and I do not want this public okay I don't want everybody to be able to see this and I don't want to advertise it to everybody on Google Plus so I'm going to get rid of that circle and I can um, add people here um, I will add let me see actually myself here so there I am. And then uh, once I invite that person uh, myself, I'll get an email with a link to that and I can say either yes or no and then in the in my Google Calendar it would show up. So there it is. I wanted to share this event with uh, Greg. So I'll share that. Now before you can move on, Google Hangout is a little tricky to set up. Um, if you haven't realized that already. So one, we had to create a Google Plus uh, profile. Two, you will have to verify a YouTube account. So, you know, I just want to apologize right up front that you have to do kind of all this setup, but once you do, once, it all, once it's all set up, uh, future Hangouts on Air, you can just, um, you know, click the Start Hangout on Air button and you're ready to go. But I need to verify my YouTube account. Basically, this verification means that you submit your a phone number, and then you either get a text message back, or you get a voice message with a code. You put that code in, like I'm going to do now. All right, so I'm going to enter in my number and submit, and then Google will immediately send me a text message and in that text message there is a six digit verification code. Alright so Google sent me the verification code I can enter that in and submit it. Great now my YouTube channel is verified so basically what that means means a couple of things. One it means I can upload videos longer than 15 minutes to YouTube and two it means I can do live events in YouTube or in Google Hangout on Air. So good, great. And right now I'm in YouTube and it shows that um, I can upload videos longer than 15 minutes and I can also uh, enable live events which I need to do. So I'll enable live events and I'll agree to the uh, service here. Great, here we are. So really, Google Hangouts on Air, you can create it in two ways. You can create it in your YouTube channel, or you can create it on Google+. Plus. And I'm going to talk about Google+, Plus because I think it's easier. You know, once you do the initial setup, you have to do the Google+, Plus setup, and then you have to do the uh, YouTube setup. But once you've done that, you can go back and uh, fill out create your Google Hangout on Air event.